Good morning, everyone. My name is Chit Aknia from Nurul Ilmi Junior High School 1. In this special occasion today, I'm going to tell you a story entitled The Legend of Tangkuban Perahu. I'm pretty sure you have heard it before because this story is very popular. So, let me just start. Once upon a time in West Java, there lived a wise king who had a beautiful daughter named Dayang Sumbi. Dayang Sumbi liked weaving very much. One day, when she was weaving, suddenly one of her tools fell to the ground. But she was too tired and too lazy to take it at the time. Then she just shouted out loud. Anybody there? Please bring me my tool. I will give you a special present. If you are a female, I will consider you as my sister. If you are a male, I will marry you. Suddenly, a male dog named Tuman came and brought her falling tool. Dayang Sumbi was very surprised, but she couldn't deny it, so she had to marry Tumang and leave her father. Then they lived in a small village. Several months later, they had a son, a handsome, a healthy son named Sang Kuryang. Growing up, Sang Kuryang liked hunting. He often went hunting to the wood using his arrow, and every time he hunted, Tumang always with him. One day, Dayang soon be craving to eat this herb. Sang Kuryang, will you hunt a deer for me? I really wanted to eat deer's herb, asked Dayang Sumbi. Of course, ma'am, I will hunt it for you. Everything you want, I'll give it for you, said Sang Kuryang. Tumang, where are you? Come on, we have to hunt for a deer. Tumang, oh, there you are. Come on, we need to hunt a deer. Then they both went to the wood. But sadly, after several days, they couldn't find any deer. They were all just disappeared. Sang Kuryang was very tired. <sighs> oh God, where could I find a deer? I don't want to disappoint my mom. Oh, I know. He then called Tumang and killed him. He didn't know that Tumang was his father. And at home, he gave Tumang's heart to his mother. Sang Kuryang, are you sure this is a dear's heart? Sang Kuryang, answer me. Are you sure this is a dear's heart? It is Tumang's heart, isn't it? Did you kill him? Why did you kill him? Dayang Sumbi was very angry. Mom, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to. I just don't want to disappoint you, Mom. I don't care. Go away from my house. She, she hit Sang Kuryang very hard. That Sang Kuryang was wounded so badly. She also repelled her son. So Sang Kuryang left her mother in sadness. Many years passed, and Sang Kuryang now became a strong young man. He wandered everywhere. And one day, he arrived at his own village. There, he met Dayang Sumbi. At the time, Dayang Sumbi was given an eternal beauty by God, so she stayed young forever. Both of them didn't know each other and fell in love and decided to marry. Until one day, Dayang Sumbi recognized the scar on Sang Kuryang's head. Sang Kuryang, why is there a scar on your head? Asked Dayang Sumbi. Oh, when I was a child, my mom hit me on my head, replied Sang Kuryang. Dayang Sumbi knew that it was her son. It was impossible for them to marry. But Sang Kuryang didn't believe it. He even wished for them to marry soon. So, Dayang Sumbi decided to give him a very difficult condition. Sang Kuryang, if you want to marry me, I want you to build a lake and a big boat in one night. Can you do that? 
asked Deng Zumbi. What? That's impossible. But okay, I'll do it for you. As long as you promise that we will marry, I'll do it for you. With the help of genies and spirits, Sang Kuryang tried to build them. By midnight, he had finished the leg by building a dam in Stardom Liver. Then, he started building the boat. It was almost done when he nearly finished it. Dayang Sumbi was watching it, was worried. Oh no, what can I do, what can I do? So, she decided to make lights in the east. Huh? Troops! Stop your work! It's already done! We need to go away! Said the char of the genie. Run, run! Woo! And all of the genie left him alone. Sangkuryang, looks like you cannot finish my condition. So, it means you can't marry me. No? Asked Dang Zumbi. What? You cheated! You make lights in the east so that my troops go away! Because of you, I couldn't fulfill the condition. Sang Kuryang was very angry that he kicked the boat. Boom. So then, the boat turned upside down and become a Mount Tangkuban Perahu. Because from a distance, it looks like a boat upside down. And I think that's all the story I can tell. From this story, we knew that it's not good to lie, especially for your parents. I'm so sorry for all the mistakes I made. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Check.